So let's get started. For this we need a microphone and with the negative pin of the microphone a 4.7 kilo ohms resistor is connected and then it is connected to ground. Then with the negative pin of the microphone we will connect one transistor, emitter of the transistor is connected to ground and with the collector a 1 kilo ohms resistor is connected and this resistor is connected to positive 6 volt. Now again we need another transistor emitter is connected to the ground with the collector 470 ohms resistor is connected and it is from plus 6 volt these transistor are BC548 now we need an IC it is triple 5 timer IC this collector is connected to pin number 2 of the IC pin number 4 and A these two are connected to positive 6 volt pin number 1 is connected to the ground and with the 5 we need to connect a capacitor and then it is connected to the ground it is 10 nanofarad pin number 3 will go to next circuit it will go to pin 14 of 4017 now pin number 6 and 7 these two pins are connected together and with this one resistor is connected Another pin of the resistor is connected to positive 6 volt. It is 33 kilo ohms. And again with this we will connect a capacitor. And then it is connected to the ground. It is 4.7 microfarad. So it is the first part of the circuit. Now we need 4017. Here it is pin 14. And this is connected from pin 3 of triple 5. It is 4017 IC. This one. Okay. This 3 is connected to this pin. Pin number 16 is connected to plus 6 volt. Pin number 8 and 13, these 2 are connected to the ground. Pin number 15 and 4, these 2 are connected together. With the pin number 3, will connect one resistor and then one LED and then it is connected to the ground it is 330 ohms and this LED is red LED now we need another IC it is MOC 3021 one LED is connected with pin number 2 of 4017 the positive pin is connected to the pin number 2 and negative pin of the LED is connected to pin number 1 of this MOC3021 IC. It is optocoupler IC and this LED is blue LED. Pin number 2 of the IC is connected to the ground. With the pin number 6, a 560 ohms resistor is connected. With the pin number 4, again one 560 ohms resistor is connected. Now we need triad. This pin is MT1 and this one is MT2. This main terminal 1, main terminal 2. And the gate of the triac is connected to pin number 4 of the IC. It is gate. This triac is BT136. This triad can handle up to 6 ampere at 220 AC volt. Now here we will connect the AC load. Here is our AC power supply and MT1 is connected with the neutral. Here is 220 volt AC. This optocoupler is isolating this high voltage part to the low voltage part and I already uploaded a video on this part link in the description below so this is the circuit now we will see this on the breadboard it is the microphone 
here this one positive pin and this one negative pin positive pin is directly connected to the positive rail putting the BC548 negative pin of the microphone is connected with 4.7 kilo ohms resistor and then it is connected to negative rail negative pin of the microphone is connected to the base of the transistor emitter is connected to the ground 1 kilo ohms resistor is connected between positive rail and the collector putting another 548 transistor collector of the first transistor is connected to base of the second transistor emitter is connected to the ground collector is connected with 470 ohms resistor and then it is connected to positive rail here it is triple 5 IC pin number 1 is connected to the negative rail and pin number 4 and 8 these both are connected to the positive rail pin number 6 and 7 these both are connected together pin number 7 is connected to the positive rail through 33 kilo ohms resistor 0 0.01 microfarad capacitor is connected to the pin number 5 and then it is connected to the negative rail 4.7 microfarad capacitor is connected to pin number 6 and the negative pin of the capacitor is connected to the negative rail collector of the second transistor is connected to the pin number 2 of triple 5 IC now put 4017 pin number 8 and 13 these both are connected to the negative rail and pin number 16 is connected to the positive rail pin number 4 and 15 these both are connected together and with the pin number 3 330 ohms resistor is connected and with this positive pin of an LED is connected and negative pin is connected to the ground with pin number 2 an LED is connected the positive pin is connected pin number 3 of triple 5 IC is connected to the pin number 14 of 4017 now we need another breadboard for high voltage connection and it is the optocoupler MOC 3021 we are isolating the high voltage circuit and low voltage circuit with optocoupler here it is BT136 and these are the pins negative pin of the green LED is connected to the pin number 1 of optocoupler and pin number 2 of the optocoupler is connected to the ground so up to this the low voltage circuit is completed now we are connecting the high voltage circuit with the pin number 4 and with the pin number 6 560 ohms resistor is connected this resistor is connected to the MT1 and this one is connected to the MT2 gate pin of the triac is connected to the pin number 4 of the optocoupler we are connecting the negative rails and the positive rails ok so this is the connection now we have to connect the AC load here I am connecting a bulb holder one pin of the load is connected to MT2 and MT1 will be connected to neutral so here is the line that is face and MT1 is connected to neutral I am connecting this bulb it is 100 watt bulb high voltage connection is completed now I am connecting 6 volt battery here is the battery positive and the negative the red LED is glowing now if I clear then this green LED will glow and the bulb So it is glowing. Again, so this is how we can make high voltage device control circuit to control high voltage device without relay. And with the BT136 trial, we can control up to 6 ampere at 220 volt. So guys this is all for today I hope you like this video if so then please like share and subscribe to my channel and if you have any doubt on this then please let me know in the comment section in the next video I'll show you another topic 
Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.